Hey, good day, happy humans. It's Sunday, March. Yeah. 29th. 29th. And it's and, uh, very unusual because we're always at church on Sunday morning, but we are. Yeah. can't go to church this morning. <laughs> no. So we're going to do a home vlog. We've never done a real home vlog, I think. Yeah. So um, vlog, vlog, V-L-O-G. Get ready to make so, some uh, breakfast. We'll do some breakfast. We're making uh, some uh, omelets right now. Some Kids some are mushrooms. watching stuff on the YouTubes. Uh, I know at 10 o'clock this morning, uh, I'm going to watch my friend uh, Threadbear on YouTube. So uh, I'll probably put that on Facebook before this goes out, this video goes out. But yeah, we're just going to have a wonderful day. Probably do some work, more yard work outside. Maybe get rid of some weeds. Eat outside later. Julie's going to ask him to have a picnic. Yeah. So uh, yeah, this is going to be us at home today, just chilling. And uh, James has to get the uh, shameless cat plug in for the day. So there we go. So we got a little bit of chicken, we got some spinach, mushrooms, and then I uh, grated some cheese. And then uh, we'll get the eggs ready here. We'll find some eggs. So uh, yeah, we had a great breakfast. What else are we going to do? I think we're going to cook some turkey bacon. Oh, some turkey bacon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. What's Joe? What's that, Joe? What? I just want to like eat food for the well, it's nice outside, so maybe maybe we will go outside. Maybe we'll eat breakfast outside. Maybe we'll be outside. Yeah, we yeah. got a lot of we got a lot of cleaning to do. Our windows dirty, <laughs> but it's all right. All right, gonna get some food going. One thing I like to do with the scrambled eggs is I put a little bit of milk in, right down here, to where it just kind of covers just a little bit of the egg right there. Not all of it. And then what we'll do is we'll whip it next. Yep, oh wait, oh yeah, also some rock salt right here. Let's put a little rock salt on the top of it. That is a ghost pepper rock salt. And then I throw pepper on the top too. Next, we're going to whip it. Whip it good. Dun 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 didn't Ninja sing that song on a Mask Singer last night? When we were watching Mask Singer? Yeah. I think. Still want Oak in there. Yo. Yeah, I got it, Joe. We're all good, buddy. I got the mushrooms getting ready to go into the pan. Right there. And then I want to throw in some butter. I got a little bit of butter left in this thing, so uh, there goes the butter. She loves it. Yep, and we'll just let we'll just let that melt down for a little bit. <laughs> got to turn the oven on, right? Turn the stove on. <laughs> oh yeah, got to turn the stove on for the turkey so, bacon. Turkey bacon, very good, but a lot more healthy than um regular bacon. Yeah. A lot less calories. <laughs> yeah. The kids really seem to like it. Yeah, it's good. So we'll fry some of that up back here. Yeah. And then I threw just a tad of cayenne pepper on top of the mushrooms. Oh, I see. So Nicole had to go do some morning work this morning, go upload some videos um, for church. But I'm making Josie her egg. Josie, what do you want on your egg, Joe? I want mushrooms. Mushrooms and? Bacon. Bacon. But and cheese? cheese. Milo's looking at leaves out there. No cheese, so it's mushrooms and bacon on your egg. That's it, right? Uh, uh, I want bacon. Okay, all right, we got you. What's purpose is happening? Gosh, guys, you're eating out here. It's yeah, really I windy. This up and, then, and, then it and then it started to blow away. Yeah, it's kind of windy right now, huh? Yeah. Well, at least you're outside. Hey, Josie, make sure you eat all of your eggs, not just the insides. I 
Milo, Ty, you're not an outside we cat. We can't leave doors open in this house. She's too curious. <laughs> She's too curious. She just likes the leaves. It wasn't even the birds. <laughs> um, I think this omelet here is going to be my omelet. Look at that big mamma jamma. It's half the pan. And it's so big. As you can see, I am going to start doing some more outside projects. One I'm working on right now is relaying some of this patio that I've got out here. I'm tired of all the weeds coming up in between every once in a while and spraying down, so I want to put on a stronger weed block. My mother-in-law says cardboard should do the trick. So, let's see how that goes. Level this back out, put some cardboard down, and then uh, maybe go get some paper base to put in between there. That may not be today. I'm still trying to do our best to practice social distancing, but I can get the groundwork laid out for this and we can go from there. Here is the semi-finished product. It's all relayed out again. But if you notice, there's gaps in between the blocks. That's because I gotta get paver base in there. And what that does, it'll keep things from shifting, level a lot of things off. What you do is you put the paver base on the top, kind of put it in between the cracks, use a tamper, and then do it again and then you can kind of go and fill where the things are at. But uh, Tatum's spending some time outside right now in the sun while it's very windy. He's probably playing Wordscape or what's the other one, Word Stacks, or watching TikTok. But yeah, so this is gonna be nice. I mean, obviously we got some more outside work to do. Uh, we gotta remulch this. What I'll do is I'll put cardboard underneath this too and put the mulch on the top. Kind of like how I did over here little trick I learned last year from somebody and uh, cardboard actually works as a very 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 good weed block um, but there's a plan for this space right here is to put a, a little pergola right there in that section about eight or nine foot tall with some shading on the top and some speakers so if I wanted to play music out here I would just stand up here on this pergola like so and then play music, have people eat food over there, sit over there and just chill, and uh, lovely sounds of our little pond, so, yep, so that's probably going to be a little bit of my outdoor project for the day, and you can tell, look how windy it is, it's crazy, Tatum just got blown away, so uh, yeah, we'll see where else the state takes us, we might go for a hike, who knows, oh, the gloves fell off, I don't know if you can see, but on our Japanese weeping cherry, we are finally getting some buds. And I hope, I really hope that it buds this year because every time we think it starts to bud and it starts looking pretty, we get a frost and it just stops the process. As you can tell, our flowers over here are growing too. Another project that I gotta work on is over here, our swing play area fort. If you look down here, last year, well, a couple years ago, we bought this thing called a blob, and it's like a big water blob. Um, and it finally sprung a leak. So what I was thinking, and I don't know, let me, correct me if I'm wrong, I hate really throwing this away. Um, my thought process is, is to 
leave this here. Put mulch on top of this and then build like a big swing for the kids to swing back and forth on. I know that Tatum's kind of out of that swing age right now, but if Josie has friends over, right Jill? If Josie has friends over, they can swing and the mulch will keep the weeds from growing. And you know what? That's just less yard that I have to cut down the road too. So, I don't know. I mean, I, I think that'll work. I don't want it to be bad for the environment. I know, it's blowing. But, you know, these are projects that we want to get done. We do want to put our house in the market. Not this summer, but hopefully next summer. Um, so, there's a lot of things that need to be done around this house to get it to get it selling shape. What are you doing, Joe? What? Oh no, Joe. They're not logging. <laughs> We've been kind of chilling this afternoon and uh, we have a early, well, is it like an early dinner or a late lunch? We've, we've been, been doing like- We've been doing this like midday meal, like to kind of, we've been having later breakfast and then like having a midday meal to kind of like eliminate having to make like two three meal. Yeah. Dinners, whatever. So it's kind of good cause like, we'll just like have a little snack tonight, cheese and crackers or salsa. And yeah, it's been kind of nice, but chips. But right now, it's funny because she's like, "I made the spaghetti with real meat." Okay. <laughs> like, so I never <laughs> buy ground meat. I always buy ground turkey. But because I was in charge of getting the meat yesterday at the but grocery yesterday, store, I did buy ground turkey. Yeah. Yesterday, but, Tyler and I did this thing where, like, so we're trying to not, you know, we're trying to keep the kids out of the store and social distancing and all. So yeah, we drove to Aldi. He sat in the car with the kids while I shopped <laughs> and got most of what we needed. And then I came out to, you know, I paid and brought the groceries out to the car. And then he went in and bought like some other things that I'm not, like, I'm just not good at picking out meat and stuff like that. Um, so he did that. So that worked out pretty good that, you know, we didn't have to bring the kids in the store and we both got to shop. But anyway, yeah. he bought, he bought ground beef and I decided to make, um, Pischetti. Spaghetti with meat sauce. Pischetti with meat sauce. For our midday meal. So yeah, I throw a little bit of cayenne pepper on mine. But the, how do you think the spaghetti so far, Josie? Thumbs up. Thumbs up? She just Thumbs likes up. watching herself. She likes watching herself on the camera. Tatum likes it. This is pretty good. She's been kind of just chilling outside today. It's been windy, but she's been sitting out in the furniture, in the, in the chair, just hanging it's out It's windy, outside. but it's beautiful out. It is gorgeous out, so. Yep, and we'll catch you up, I guess, a little bit later. We'll probably go watch some Masked Singer. Yeah, we've been trying to binge watch this. Maybe play some uh, Jackbox party games tonight, which would be fun to play. So. We've just been chilling the rest of the day after dinner. We kind of got in like a food coma, I guess. I don't know, but we've just been chilling. Nicole's been reading her books. Kids have been playing games. Uh, what am I doing? I don't even know. I might've picked up the guitar a couple times. Maybe looked outside the window. <laughs> I don't know. But now the kids are uh, milking cows on the game. <laughs> so uh, <laughs> they're learning how to milk a cow on a video game. So that's fun, I guess. <laughs> are you milking the cow all right there, Josie? All right, make sure you get plenty of milk. All right. Oh, James, you won that one. Yeah. Play some more games later, I think. Some Jackbox games. Those are fun games, too.
You hit your son in the head. Mom! Not me! <laughs> Not me! We got this game tonight Impersonate. called Impersonate. We've never played it, but I have a feeling it's going to play a lot like... Watch this. <laughs> I have a feeling it's going to play a lot like the uh, Heads Up games. <laughs> and uh, we'll see, what it, see how it goes. But it looks like it's going to be fun. I know, it was a free game on the Amazon Fire Stick app, so if you have Amazon Fire Stick for your TV, uh, check it out. We'll see what it's like. Yeah. Will Smith was in this movie. Spaceships, flying around against aliens. Oh, Iron Legend? No, spaceships. Oh, but it, um... Fourth of July. Independence Day. Oh, oh, your favorite show, Danny DeVito, um, uh, Nightman. So what's that in Philadelphia? Yeah. It's, a, it's a good show. It's another type of lizard, but you see him, he's like the Geico lizard, but he's not Geico. Dragon he's... lizard? No. He doesn't know Geico. <clears throat> um, Gecko? There yeah. you go. It's a pink bird that stands on one leg. Flamingo. Who's the leader hey. of the club? The we see him at Disney movie. World with big ears. Mickey Mouse! Yes. <laughs> oh, uh, oh, um. No dip. Watson, Watson. Oh, um. No. No, what no dip. Um, Sherlock. Yes. Can I get them all? Yeah. <laughs> the, little, the Little Mermaid, what's the Little Mermaid's name? Uh, Belle. The, the Little Mermaid, <laughs> what is her name? With the red hair? Uh, Ariel. Yeah. yeah. Who are uh, you gonna call? Uh, who's the, is, it, is it Princess one? <laughs> it wasn't a Princess one. <laughs> it was Ghostbusters, Jesse. You tried. You did pretty good. I already tried pretty to good catch too. one. Uh, this was a movie that came out filmed over years. Um, <clears throat> Like James is currently. Boyhood. Yeah. No, the bad guys in Lion King. No, it's a, it's a it's a laughing like dog animal. They're evil in Lion King. They're evil in the Lion King. Oh, those like coyotes? No, they're like in Lion King, like the. They are in Lion King. Ugh! I I passed out. Uh, this is a very furry little animal. It's fluffy. Panda. Little animal you can have in a cage. Aww. No, in the cage. <laughs> Pet. Cat? No. Cats are pets. You don't put cats in a cage. <laughs> Not a bird. frog, but it's a... Yeah. Bird! That's a chinchilla. Oh. So that concludes our day. It was crazy. Busy. We got work done. Stuff done. Had dinner. Played games with the kids at the end of the night. And uh, that was our first home vlog, I guess. So, uh... That being said, as we always say, guys, be a happy human. Peace out. Now it's time for bed.